it's dark, but this is heavy, so I'm gonna get out the way. But if I die today, if I die today, I die knowing that I tried to present a lifestyle for a child for them to have a lifestyle that God meant for them to have. I died knowing that I presented his word in a way for a child. For that child to have something that God wanted them to have. If I died today, I know I presented scripture and showed scripture that was beneficial to a child. So a young lady will never have to talk about how strong she is. Not unless God made her that strong. I present a structure where a young man will want to be on child support. A young man want to be a father to a child and a husband to his wife. I talked about Proverbs 3.15, which mentions, which mentions how precious a woman is, a black woman that is. Nothing compares to her. If I die today, I may mention of Ephesians 6, 1 through 3 where it talks about honor their father and their mother. I may mention of how strong that and is. It has always been that strong because that and is God. It joins husband and wife together. If I died today, I died knowing that I spoke of Genesis one twenty eight on such a level that I had people that supposed to believe in God and people that are supposed to be of the cloth and people that are supposed to be on the side that I talked about Genesis 128 and the content of Genesis 128 to the point folks want to shoot me. Yeah, I said it. I talked about God. I made mention of God in the way that it's supposed to be. I made mention of Deuteronomy 23 verse 2 where it says the bastard should not enter into the congregation of the Lord into a 10 generation. If I died today, my dad today, I know I'll present a water.